Hey everyone, welcome to part 2 of my long play of Mega Man Extreme. In this part I'll be tackling the hard mode section of the stream. If you haven't yet watched it, check out part 1 where I start the game fresh and go through the first part of the story. Anyway, let's get on with the video. I guess we get hard mode now. We don't have to rewatch this, right? Oh, I keep pressing that by accident. I mean, it's not like anything important is shown. Like you can kind of see there at the bottom. Like, <laughs> a local IP address for uh, sending stuff over to the, uh, to the GameCube. Anywho. Oh, whoops. Wait a minute. I think I screwed up something. It let me pick hard mode. Reset. I probably goofed. I more than likely goofed. Maybe I was supposed to hit continue? Wait, do I still get to keep the Shoryuken? HECK YEAH! This place is familiar. Why am I here? So, do they just make me redo the, uh... The stage for whatever reason? Wait, does... That mean I have... I have the two sub-tanks. I have all the previous weaknesses. Weaknesses, uh boss things. You know what? The first time I beat this game, I don't think I did this. Whoa! That's twice that that almost happens. I really am digging the way this controller feels. This is not a bad controller at all. Like how I have zero lives because I beat the game with zero lives. Zero, tell me what's happening. The mother computer, which was restored, is now not working again. <laughs> again. I don't believe it. We found illegal access records in the mother computer. Someone must have accessed the data secretly. That person has been reprodu- That person has been reproduces the fighting? That person has been reproduces the fighting data. <sighs> so, uh, the translation needs some work. Of the past. In order to fix the mother computer, we will need to fight our enemies again in their data form. Zero, I'll do it. Okay, you handle this, and I'll look into who is behind this evil plan. Be sure to watch out. Alright, here we go. 
Epileptic seizure warning. Alright, we got Wheel Gator, Magna Centipede, Armored Armadillo, and Morph Moth. So we get three bosses from X2 and one from X1. So I guess I'll deal with uh, Armored Armadillo first. It's, you know, he's just an armadillo. And it should have his weakness already, right? Because technically... Do I have anybody else's weakness? I'm not sure. Well, for Morph Moth, I have his weakness too. Oh, well, we'll see. Da -da 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 -da. Armored Armadillo! Do 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 Wait a minute. Aw. They didn't put him. Remember that the original bat was down here? I don't see him. Oops. Forgot I had zero lives. That's okay, because we got a third uh, sub tank. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. There's a heart container that I guess if I'm not in front of him, I won't be able to get. Or if I don't destroy him before he destroys that. But in the first game, I had to use a Flame Mammoth's weapon. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It's not kidding me. That was not where... That was not what I thought it was going to be. I feel juked! Whoa, not cool, game. I mean, at least it, it gave me a chance to, to avoid it. Oh, it's up here. Oh no! Oh no! I, I have no words. I have no words. Oh, this is where the... I already have the, all the parts. What is this? Enter this capsule X, install the program Zero Scramble Dash. This program will allow you to call your best partner Zero. The range of the attack is limited, but it can help a lot if you use it wisely. Be careful about your energy. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. That's not it. Oh wait, is it this? Okay, I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but okay. I, I believe he is weak to electric spark. charged for it to do it? I don't know. Oh, well, yeah, I guess so. Oh, well, I ran out of electric spark. Shoryuken! Never jump into a Shodoken character. They're just gonna Shoryuken. Also, I should have definitely 100% lost that fight. You got the Rolling Shield. Kiki Ki, disgusting X. How could you beat me last time? I didn't beat you last time. We beat Zane last time. I'll pay you back for that. I'm going to mess up the data on the mother computer. I hope you have fun fixing my mess, X. Alright, so we got three things out of that level, right? That was not expected. So now the question is, who do I want to tackle next? Part of me wants to say... I don't know. Guess we can do Wheel Gator? Because I think in the regular game I needed his power up for something in Morph Moth stage, so I guess we'll do we'll do Wheel Gator, even though he's kind of annoying. Wheel Gator! Oh, it's not moving. Here. Install the program Zero Scramble Rising. This program will allow you to call your best friend and fellow soldier Zero. His striking power is enormous but hard to control. Perform this on enemies in the sky. It also works on bosses. Alright, so we have another Zero power. 
Oh boy, my favorite, these moving platforms. I like how I just messed with the song in the game. Is there anything up here? Nope. Oh man, I wanted to take it with me. Oh, I keep accidentally doing that. Oh, an extra life? I'll take it. Oh, I, I get the feeling I know what I'm supposed to do here. Yep, I was right. Not what I wanted. <laughs> that was an extra life. Oh my gosh. That's not the controller's fault, that is 100% me, by the way. I won't blame the controller when it's my fault. Hey. Hey, what's through here? Oh, it's Sneaky Mel. Kiki Ki! I've been waiting for you, X. I'm going to take the time to stop you here and finish you off once and for all. Okay, I don't know what your uh, pattern is. Oh, do you just throw boomerangs? Oh, okay. I don't think I can even call it a boomerang because it uh, doesn't come back. Oops. I gotta be aware of when he teleports, I guess. Key! This can't be! Don't think you've defeated me just because you've won this round. Yeah. Do do do. Anything up here? This looks neat. Oh, this is where I would have normally come out from. Oh, never mind. I was ahead of the song. <laughs> How many moons are there? Help, please, please, nope. Oh, my gosh, it looks so awkward. Oh, this is gonna be bad. What is his weakness? Because he is not taking any kind of damage. Aside from the fact that he's ultra annoying. Just doesn't take damage normally, I guess.
No, seriously, like, I've shot him point blank at specific points, but there's no indicator of why he's not taking damage. Oh my... Really? Oh my gosh. you can you then because you're getting really annoying if it wasn't for the show you can I don't think I'd be winning this fight Nope, it didn't, it didn't work! And he instantly went underwater. Or oil, or whatever this is. It, he's just invincible the entire time. And he just ducked underwater. He's not flashing, he's not doing anything that would otherwise indicate what the situation is. I'm not a fan of that. But we beat him! You got spin wheel. Now we get to turn green. All right, so I guess we'll do morph moth. I do like that the characters are faithfully recreated, like an 8-bit. That is pretty cool. I know I've said that before, but every time I see what one of the bosses looks like... If you're wondering why I stopped playing, uh... Oh, hello. I'm gonna go back to Mega Man X Collection. Don't worry. But I'm doing this in between, because this game technically falls there. And I picked it up recently, so... I keep forgetting I have to actually select it. Alright, so it should be, like, here, right? This is where the secret normally is. So what do we have here? Enter this capsule, X! Install the program Zero Scramble Earth Geyser. This program will allow you to call your best friend, Zero! You can damage enemies around you. This requires a lot of energy. Use this only in desperate situations. Sure. So, how many of zero thingies does that make? We got three zero parts. Might as well see what it looks like. Oh, it's a screen clear thing, it looks like. And then X was stuck there forever because he didn't properly cut out the thingies. Hey, don't shoot at me. Huh. This also looks suspicious. I doubt that there's anything here, but my curiosity is going to get the better of me. It should only be there. They added this fight too? That's interesting. Oh, 
Oh, this is not done. Alright, I got rid of him. Ran into you guys earlier. I hate all of you. Oh, you're just gonna perfectly follow along and, and just hit at just the right angles every single time. Holy smokes. Whoa! That was close. a bunch of health to whatever enemies. I can't fill up my sub tanks unless I have full health. So every time they uh they take a little bit of my health away, it's really annoying. Any more of you guys up here? Weapon energy. The one thing I could more often and not care less about. How we doing on that weapon energy, by the way? Got well, one full sub tank. I got two of them on me. I gotta make sure that I'm extra cautious. I think we got Morph Moth coming up here. Oh wait, no. I was not expecting that. I'm sure he wasn't expecting that. Thanks. Well, no introduction, huh? Just straight straight into the fight, huh? around. The other one basically almost let me kill him in X2. Guess he's learned his lesson. Do 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 boo boo do 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 boo do You got the silk shot. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we're almost there. Last thing left is a uh, Magna Centipede stage. This enemy is from this stage.
Can I really not make it unless I use the speed burner here? That is kind of baloney, because I really feel like he can make it. Anyway, let's not waste any more time. What's up here? Aha! Can we finish getting up there and getting our help? It'd be nice! Oh no! And I knew it was gonna happen! And it happened during my X2 Let's Play! Oh my goodness. What? I didn't expect it to drop until, like, I was directly underneath it, but it dropped early, so then when I decided to dash, it hit me. Oh my goodness. I'm dying in a lot of goofy ways right now. You're gonna- you're gonna drop? Cause you didn't do that before. Anything up here? Nope. I don't trust you. Hmm, interesting that it's going up. Let me guess. Well, again. What's up here? the last of the sub-tanks. Wait, why does it still have that? His animations are <laughs> not anywhere near as smooth. Take it. Oh, this part. Remember that super annoying trophy? That apparently... It completely... Huh. Hold up. Oh. Something up here, huh? Uh, really? Twice? Enter this capsule, X. Install the program Zero Scramble Final. This will allow you to call a special A-level hunter, Zero. This is the most powerful weapon and will destroy almost any enemy. Keep in mind that this requires a huge amount of energy. Use this on strong enemies that may seem impossible to defeat. So like Sigma? I'm gonna use it on Sigma, is that what you're telling me? I thought it was gonna be something down there. But I figured since every level already had a zero thingy for me to collect, there should have been one here, so when I didn't see it there... I figured I should explore that room. Yeah, I know, you, uh, you're a lot more powerful because you scanned me like a billion times.
Hadouken. Why would you shoot it the opposite way, X? Hadouken. Oh yeah, I did use speed burner a lot, huh? I forgot you had that power. Now what was your weakness? I doubt it's that. Actually, would it be that? I guess it is, and I just didn't remember. get MM. You got the magnet mine. X, you finally cleared all the protections. All right, I'm going to go to the core. Good luck, X. I guess we're going to the core. Literally, okay. We're going through the same stages, I reckon. Oh, that didn't work. That's not good. Why didn't that work? Because it wasn't close enough. Oh boy. Hadouken? Okay, Hadouken worked. Kind of wondering why, why it wasn't working. I mean, I didn't need to do it to kill him, but I thought it was gonna be funny to like show you can a turtle, giant tank-like turtle that shoots, you know, missiles on its shell. Anything to get rid of those guys, just because they're super annoying every time. So who are we gonna face this time? Nobody. Because we're gonna face him here. And I don't know what difference he's gonna do, but I'm sure he'll have a slight variation. I've been waiting for you, X Kiki. -ki. You seem to be having problems. I'll give you another problem to deal with. I only gave him that voice because he laughed like with Kiki. -ki. All right, then he does that. Alright, but, uh, what's your gimmick? Because your buddy had a gimmick whenever... Oh! Well, I just found your gimmick! I just found your gimmick, and I don't like it! Start flying around like an idiot! Got it! Oh my goodness. This is legitimately annoying. 
Shoryuken! I have one health! I'm gonna consume that little bit. Kai! How frustrating! You got like a little glider, or sideways magic carpet or something. Oh no. No, 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 no. Do I have to fight Boss Fighter again? I don't want to fight Boss Fighter. Don't make me do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to. I'll eat my vegetables. Don't make me face the Boss Fighter. I mean, I have even more health than I did before, but that doesn't mean that I want to face the boss spider. Great. What? I, I don't have time for this. I mean, thanks for the extra life, but that's not what I want. It's nice that you gave me such a huge amount of health. Can you give me more of those? I will continue to take the extra lives. Happily, we'll take the extra lives, but there's something that is much more useful to me than the extra lives, and that's the health right now. I'm trying to restock. Extra lives. Do -do -do. Oh my gosh, another life. I don't think I've ever seen the number nine in this game. How are we doing? Oh man, we're doing pretty bad. I mean, we have two full ones. I wish we had more than two full ones. Isn't it bad how much I'm paranoid of boss fighter that I'm doing this? You might be thinking to yourself, well, you did it last time in one. Like, was it one? One, uh, health tank? You Clearly, you can do it again. But I don't want to chance it. That's that I have nine lives. Okay, we filled one up. Gotta fill up the other one. Oh, 
but it keeps giving me like the super tiny ones and when it gives me the super tiny ones it's kind of like whatever weapon energy. Oh my gosh. The little ones give so little health for the sub tank, it's like comically stupid. Look at this. It, that's barely anything. I wonder if they'll still give me extra lives. I wonder if we can go past 9. Maybe it'll show me a 10. As it is, I've never seen an 8 before. Like, for the health. Uh, the health. The, the lives. I'm sorry. I know this is ultra boring. Oh, it did give us an extra life, but the counter stayed at 9. Does that mean I have 10 lives, but it only shows no Oh my gosh, did you really have to hit me? Now I have to wait till more health drops before I can collect more for the sub tank. It's already bad enough that they don't always drop it. Hey, 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 I, I don't appreciate that. That I do. I, I really appreciated that, thank you. Oh my god, it's almost there. Please! think that's full? No! Why? I hate them so much. I'm missing one little crouton of health. I'm pretty sure I have full health, but I wanted to hear the sound effect, just, like, not do anything to confirm it. Now I have to wait for another health drop. Oh my gosh. Okay, now it was full. Uh, 11 lives, presumably. All right, boss spider. You, you annoyance, you. I panicked. Oh my god, I panicked. right on top of me. It went up immediately before my shot could hit it. Make me have to waste a char two charge shots. 
scum. Scum. Absolute scum. I hate the stupid boss. We're neck and neck. Just die. Just die. What? What? I thought I would live by a little bit, but I didn't. Oh my god. Oh, and look, the, the nine lives don't add up. So I didn't have 11 lives. It just stops at nine. Great. Fantastic. What? Just so you guys know, it's... You press down and jump, and then that, like, makes you dash. I've been doing that because sometimes the game doesn't like it when I double tap. And it failed me, and instead it just made me jump right into the stupid spider. I can't stand this boss. This is the worst boss in the universe. This is, like, I feel almost the worst boss in it of any Mega Man game ever. Three times that he shot out spiders! Not cool game. I don't I don't like you. Making me hate spiders. Great. Oh, just like last time, huh? He gets to live by one health? Screw you. Get out of here! Yes, save and continue. This is the same stage. It is the exact same stage as last time. Wait, I didn't use any sub tanks that last time. Still an annoying fight. Still got paranoid for good reason. Why am I even doing this? I don't have to do this. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. not. I don't even have to take this path, so I don't even know why I'm doing it. But I want to see if there's something in the secret hidden spot again.
Oh my god! I forget that it's there every time. That was, that was really smooth of me, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm actually really proud of myself. <laughs> Speaking of smooth... Everything but this section. Now I have more health than before. I have more health and more lives. God, I was holding down because I was getting ready to do the stupid Hadouken. And then he dashed. Ugh. sections ever because there's so much going on and there's only one very specific weak spot and if you don't hit him it doesn't count if you hit the cart it doesn't count it has to be him see like there that hit the cart so it doesn't count as damage on him and it hit the cart again so it doesn't count as damage on him As if this needed to be any more challenging. Come on! Yeah. I don't have a choice but to use one of the sub tanks. What was his weakness? Fire. But again, unless it hits him, it doesn't count. I like just to spite me how easily it hit him there. X, finally, you can enter the core. All right, I'm gonna go to the core. Okay, bye. And then this is gonna be the boss rush.
Really, that didn't count. Armored Armadillo is down. I'm an idiot because I forgot that I could come up here and collect health. Great. My gosh. I was nowhere near it. Got to dodge it. That's the only reason Wheel Gator is hard. It gets like a billion invincibility frames. He's down. Goodbye, Magnus Centipede. We hardly knew he almost full health. Is that the last one? Yep. All of them are down. Goodbye, Morph Moth. And we're minus a sub tank. This is the part where I fight a billion bats. Yep. as well get my weapon energy back, but let's be honest, what I want is help. But I will try. 
try to get my uh, weapon energy back because I did use a lot of it. Of course, the billion bats. I didn't expect those to spawn right away, and they did. So I got a couple more to go. It's crazy how quickly weapon energy charges, but not health energy. I did not expect that brigade of bats. Okay, for sure everything is filled up. Yep. I did not expect that. You made it! Sigma! You've been behind all of this. Didn't you think it was strange that you could defeat me with such easy tactics? You're no wiser than before, X. Now you will pay for your ignorance. Um, so are you gonna do something different, or...? Of course, I decide to drop down and lose almost all of my health. Come on, keep slashing at the wall. I hate everyone right now. Because <laughs> I ended up throwing away a fully charged shot. Twice! I'm doing amazing! Yeah, keep swatting that mosquito. You'll eventually get him. He didn't turn around! Okay, I'm beginning to think it's not the controller. And it's the game. Because it just happened again. Where I was like, not hugging the wall anymore, but the game continued to make me hug it. Again! It just did it again! Like, there's no- Anyone watching this right now, you could tell. There's no reason for me to just let myself drop, like, facing the wrong wall intentionally for that long. It's like the hit collision doesn't know what to do. Come on, do your wall jump. Stop swatting flies. No matter what you do, it'll be in vain. Ha ha ha. X, it was Sigma again who was behind everything. We're going to destroy Sigma's hiding place completely. To scatter their power, we'll split up from now. Okay, let's go. This time there is no techno. That's kind of depressing. You're here again. We had fun last time, but playtime is over. Ha ha ha. Get ready to be destroyed. It'll be the final battle. I'll finish you at any cost. It's literally the same boss fight. if he has any different attacks, but it's the same boss fight. The only difference is I haven't seen him do the flamethrower thing yet. But I will, uh, I will take this. This has been the smoothest. Oh, there's the flamethrower. Oh, well. Oh.
Why? Why do you win all the time? Where does your power come from? Kua! We did it. Again, we did it. We cleaned out the enemies. We can escape from here. Alright, let's go. Thanks to X and Zero's work, Sigma's ambition to take over the computer world was stopped. But evil is very tough to completely stop. It's a very weird way to word that. When evil emerges again, they'll be there to fight. For now, we can only hope that the world will give X and Zero some peace. We got another staff roll. This is the second time we beat the game, technically. And people's names written in uh, code, I guess. Are we gonna see so and so's mom again? Asagiri 3. It was like background art or whatever, right? Ryutaro's mama. I still haven't uploaded the Mega Man X2 playthrough. I need to get on that. And eventually I'll have to upload this one. Although I somehow don't think I'm done yet. Actually, I'm not sure if I'm done or not. I feel like there's gonna be a third round of things to do. Toshio Kajino. Hashimoto Murata. We did it! Oh, what the heck? A challenge from Techno? Humph. You have done very well. I didn't expect that you would defeat the hard mode. But do you have what it takes to complete the extreme mode? Which I program for you. This is an awesome mode. Containing eight stages to clear. Keep in mind that you can't use the save data that you've cleared? There are no story sequences, as it is specialized just for battle. So why don't you save your data here and go for it, if you have the guts. Hope to see you again. <laughs> well... Hey everyone, hope you enjoyed part 2 of the stream archive where I focus on Mega Man Extreme's hard mode. If you made it this far, I just want to say thanks for watching all the way through. The next part should focus on the extreme difficulty of the game. If you like what you saw, please let me know what you think in the comments down below. Subscribe to my channel to help it grow, click the little bell icon to be in the know, and I'll see you guys in the next video or stream. Until then, take care.